Texas Property Group is one of Australia's leading real estate groups investing directly in high-quality Australian office and industrial properties. With $19.1 billion of assets under management, the group also actively manages office, industrial and retail properties located in key Australian markets on behalf of third-party capital partners. I'm Carolyn Herbert and joining me at the CEO sessions in Sydney is DEX's Chief Operating Officer, Craig Mitchell. Craig, welcome back. Thank you, Caroline. Craig, can you start by giving us an introduction to DEX's Property Group? Yeah, DEX's Property Group is a real estate investment trust and manages $19.5 billion worth of real estate in Australia. Half of that real estate is on our balance sheet and half of that real estate is managed in third-party funds. It's a fully integrated um, company where we do the property management, asset management and development in-house, and we're underpinned by a strong balance sheet with a low leverage of about 28%. And now to your full year results for 2015, what were the highlights? It was a strong 2015. Our funds from operation, which is our underlying earnings, was $544.5 million, a strong year. We're up nearly 9.5% on earnings per share and in dividend per share. Our return on equity was 11.5%. And we had strong trading profits of nearly 42 and a half million after tax. And now to the DEX's property portfolio. How is your office portfolio performing? Yeah, our office portfolio is performing exceptionally well. Yeah, we've got 7.8 billion um, under management um, on our balance sheet. Occupancy is 95%. The majority of our portfolio is in the Sydney CBD, where we have 60% of our portfolio. In fact, if you look at our portfolio, one in four buildings in the Sydney CBD we either own or manage. And can you tell us about some of your acquisitions? Yeah, we've been very active in acquisitions. Just recently we settled a, a large office building in Brisbane called Waterfront Place for $635 million. That was acquired 50% with our wholesale fund, DWPF, and our balance sheet on very good metrics, about $9,600 a square metre. And what's the size of your development portfolio? So we're now moving into the phase where we're activating our development pipeline. Um, we have a development pipeline of about three and a half billion dollars. So just over a billion dollars of that of that pipeline is on our balance sheet, and two and a half billion um, is in our third party. An example of that would be Five Martin Place in Sydney, where we've got a premium office building. We're just coming to completion in November of this year. And now to the funds management business. What were the highlights, and where are clients looking to invest? Our funds management business is a growing part of our business. Um, today we have $9.6 billion um, in funds under management in that business. Um, the business was making nearly $18 million EBITDA in 2012 and we're giving guidance for FY16 of making $45 to $50 million EBITDA. Our investors are looking for core real estate in the three sectors of office, industrial and retail only um, in Australia. So we're seeing good growth. An example, when we acquired the CPA portfolio um, over a year ago, we achieved a levered return of just under 20% in the first year. And finally, Craig, what's your outlook for FY 2016? 2016, uh, we've got a very strong outlook for 2016. If you go back for the last three years, we've averaged 8.6% um, dividend per share growth. In 2016, we're giving guidance of uh, earnings per share and dividend per share growth of 55 to 6%. In addition, we expect to see strong net tangible asset growth um, in 16 as well. Craig, thanks for the update on Dex's Property Group. Thank you.